one, Captain. Thanks to my expert teaching, you know how to wash dishes, the walls of the gadget house, and the car. Yes, Inspector. All right, now, I'll start to teach you the rules of crime fighting. Here, hold this. Rule number one. The law is the same for everyone, no matter who. No exceptions. For instance, that street cleaner's caught is parked illegally. Even though it is a city service, it must be ticketed. Absolutely right, oh great inspector. Inspector Gadget here. Yes, Chief, I'll be right there. Here are your secret instructions, Gadget. For Mad's eighth anniversary, eight bold crimes are scheduled to be committed. Stop them. This message will self-destruct. What's this? You're illegally parked, Chief. Inspector Gadget is always on duty. And so is Corporal Cape Man. <laughs> I'm flying! Whee! <laughs> well, Gadget, while you're busy teaching your assistant about law, I'll show Metro City my unlimited power with eight crimes. We're ready, Dr. Claw. Metro City Museum, crime number one. <laughs> Dum -dum 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 -dum. Tell me what you observed, Capman. Well, I see a crowd looking at the fabulous Klopman diamond. It's supposed to be worth a cool million. Next rule, my young apprentice, how to recognize a fake from the real thing. Now to investigate. False alarm, folks. Don't worry. Now, let's continue. The difference between a fake and the real thing... <laughs> what is this? is all set. Brain! <laughs> Say, this place is filled with smoke. Don't these people know it's against the law to smoke in the museum? Go, go, get it late. There, that's better. Brain, I'm going to follow the mad agents. You make sure Uncle Gadget gets this clue. Right. This roof is a great place to observe lawbreakers without them seeing us. Hmm. Aha! What did I tell you? Look down there. Tell me what you observed, son. 
I see a little old lady holding a candle and standing next to a baker's push cart. Exactly. Undoubtedly, a mad agent who stole that bakery man's cart full of baked goods. You there! Stop! Thief! Right! Allow me the honor of the arrest, oh wonderful inspector. Petuous youth. Go, go, gadget copter. I'm flying! Wee! Yay! Yay! Whoa! Follow that old lady. Police business. Whoa! <laughs> Another clue. Hey, Cockman, wait for me! One down and seven to go. It'll be a bright anniversary, Mad <laughs> Brain, come in, Brain. Brain, lead Uncle Gadget and Capey to the Metro City Art Center. That's where the possible robbery could take place. I'll join you there. <laughs> Wait, mad agent! Go, go, gadget handcuffs! Huh? huh? Say, little girl. Did you see a little old lady? That evil mad agent scared that little girl. Let's go, Captain. Oh. Brain, come in, hurry. That's dangerous. Captain, while I give that girl a good talking to, you look for that lady mad agent. Yes, sir. Now then, little girl, do you realize how dangerous it is to jaywalk? Whoa, whoa. <coughs> huh? Hi, cleaning men. Have you seen a suspicious-looking little old lady inside? Uh, first, can you help us with these, uh... A Corporal Cape Man is always ready to lend a helping hand. Here, let me get those. Thanks a lot. Our boss will appreciate it. Just as I thought. I have to find a way to stop these mad agents. Okay, go ahead. In any case... Hey, wait, hey, kid. Don't you know hitchhiking is against the law? Are you okay, little girl? Well, I hope you learned your lesson. No more jaywalking and no more hitchhiking. It's okay, Brain. We'll just have to track the van to their next crime and somehow make Uncle Gadget stop them. Birthday present number three coming up, Dr. Claw. Wonderful. Why are we stopping here, Inspector? Remember what I said about strong evidence? Well, that may look like an ordinary armored car, but my instinct says it may be a mad van. See some identification. It's open. What's going on here? Shh. Too many robberies around, so we're taking the money to the bank in that unmarked van. So that's it. <laughs> Glad to help. Ouch. checks out, but you're parked in front of a fire plug. Move along before I have you towed away. 
Good luck! And I'll keep the secret. <sighs> Ouch! What? That's... Aha! Uh -huh. The great inspector is giving me a test on law and order by parking next to a fire hydrant. What was rule number one again, oh spectacular boss? The law is the same for everyone. No exceptions. Why? Just wanted to be sure. Take it away. Well done, Cape Man. You save us a lot of work. It's a little late, but here's your invitation, Gadget. <laughs> So I followed rule one and had you towed to the impound yard. Someone doesn't warn them, things will get worse. I've got to stop this. Go, go, gadget on. I saw that. If you want to keep your job, fella, be a little more careful how you park the cars. Phew. All right, Captain. Time to get back to work. Back the car down. Consider it done, oh great one. Whee! Go, go, gadget lights. Wow! are at it again at the Metro City Harbor. A special thanks from your favorite charity, folks. Mad's Dr. Claw. <laughs> now all we have to do is take care of the port. Place the candle. Nice driving, Captain. I think you're almost ready to try forward gears. Wowzers! Go, go, gadget car lifters! Something's fishy, Captain. Park the car while I check out this warehouse. Check, Inspector. Mad agents are hiding in this warehouse. You can't fool these gadget eyes. Don't move, you're under arrest. Okay, put your hands up and form a single line. But we're sinking. A warehouse sinking? Not likely, my mad friend. We're not mad agents. We're innocent rich, rich people who were robbed by mad agents. That's simple to prove. Show me some ID other than this candle. They took our wallets. Just as I thought. A gang of cleverly disguised mad agents. Well, it won't work. Wowzers. What? How insidious. A sinking warehouse. Just in the nick of time. Take them away. I have to prepare for my next case. Go, go, gadget, light. 
Lux as thou mad has finally made their move. We've got to round up the rest of the gang. I guess the air conditioner is out of order. Better head home. That's right, Gadget. You'd better go home. A wonderful present from me is waiting there. Prepare for the last two candles. Number seven, destroy the Gadget house. And number eight... Destroy Gadget! <laughs> Uncle Gadget and Capey are safe at home. Now, I've got to put the house on top security to protect them until the chief gets here. What's Penny up to now? Well, how was your first day as trainee police inspector, Capman? Great! You're the greatest teacher. Now, next rule. To always trust your chief. Look, Chief Quimby is sending two backup agents. Sent you two to help, eh? But, good inspector, they look like mad agents. What better cover? Besides, the chief would never send mad agents. You perfect logic. Why didn't I think of that? Right this way, fellas. And be careful. If the chief sent you, there must be mad agents on the premises. Yeah, we know. Brains, I've contacted the chief. Until he gets there, take care of Uncle Gadget. Right. More candle littering. Let's split up and find out who's littering around here. Captain and I will start at the top and work our way down. You fellas take the basement and work your way up. Yes, sir, Inspector. He took the candles away. That made our job easier. Whoa, you Remember the rules? Wowzers. Okay, Captain. Which one applies in this case? To identify a fake at first sight. Correct. That bush is definitely a fake. It's surely mad. Brilliant, my illustrious leader. The next rule is a complete and thorough interrogation. I shall now capture him for the interrogation. Fly, Cape Man! Fly! Gotcha! All right, start talking. Think we should be leaving? You bet. There's enough explosives in those birthday candles Gadget's been gathering up to blow this place sky high. <laughs> All right, if you won't talk here, we'll just have to take you down to headquarters. It's okay. Fellas, you can leave. We've got the culprit. Hey, guys, take this evidence back to police headquarters. Go, go, Gadget Copter. I'll set the control for the bomb candles. You forgot something. In 
In any case, we got them. And those rich folks are safe and sound. All in a day's work, Chief. And here's the last of the mad agents, Chief. Careful, he's a tough one. <laughs> You've ruined my mad anniversary, Gadget. I'll get you next time. I'll get you! Gardening can be a lot of fun. That's right, Penny. But there's one very important part of gardening. A good gardener always finishes his job by cleaning up afterwards and putting away his tools. That's right. Then they're ready for the next job. And it helps prevent accidents. Oh! <laughs> You're absolutely right, Glorious Inspector. 